The murder of Mary Pinchot Meyer, a prominent Washington socialite, peace activist, and rumored JFK mistress, remains unsolved after decades. Now, author Peter Janney of Beverly says he's cracked the case with a theory that sketches out a vast conspiracy. Mary Pinchot Meyer was murdered 11 months after President Kennedy was, and just barely three weeks after the Warren Commission had been released in September 24, 1964. And this was a murder that was sort of execution style, but set up, in my opinion, by the CIA to make it look like it was a random act of violence. In his book, Mary's Mosaic, Janney not only contends that the CIA conspired to murder Meyer, he also accuses the agency of planning JFK's assassination. It's my contention that the CIA had to get rid of her because she was outraged when the Warren Commission came out. She believed the media was engaged in a huge cover-up. And all through 1964, she had been working on her own in terms of really finding out what actually had taken place in Dallas. Mary Meyer was well-connected. Her ex-husband, Cord, was a high-ranking CIA official. Her brother-in-law was Washington Post editor Ben Bradley. Janney's father, Wistar, was also a high-level CIA official, and Janney became a lifelong friend of Meyer. In the book, Janney speculates on his father's role in the story in light of a conversation recounted in Ben Bradley's 1995 memoir. No one knew who she was because she carried no identification with her. And so my father makes what appears to be an innocuous phone call to Ben and say, Ben, there's been a murder on the towpath, and, and by the sound of it, it sounds like it could be Mary. Do you know where Mary is? And I scratched my head uh, with this for quite a while because my father was not particularly fond of Mary Meyer. Why would he be sitting around his office thinking about her? And why would he even know her daily routine of taking walks on the towpath? Within hours of the murder, Ray Crump Jr. was arrested, then acquitted at trial. Two key pieces of evidence have never been found the murder weapon, and Meyer's diary, which Janney thinks may have revealed her affair with Kennedy and who may have wanted to kill her. It's like the 18 and a half minute of Watergate tape that we don't know what's really on it. You know, that's the kind of mythology that Mary Meyer's diary, I think, begins to take on in Washington.